Seal and Pax semi-automatic paste filling machine with stirrer tank accurately and consistently deliver a measured volume of a product to a container. This machine is ideal for filling medium to high viscous paste such as mayonnaise, pickles, salsa which are not free-flowing and has pieces and chunks in it. This piston filler machine measures and delivers products to your container with the help of a single piston pump. A large tank with stirrer is provided with this machine in order to fill your products. Attach the filling nozzle to the machine. To do so, open the connecting anchor, take the filling nozzle, and properly place it on the outlet. Then, tighten the filling nozzle by closing the connecting anchor. In order to operate this machine, it needs an air source to fill and discharge the product. So, the next step would be to connect the air source to the machine. Once that is done, we can attach the main power cable to the machine and turn on the green button. If the emergency switch is on, you can turn it off to start the operation. If you want to use the machine in auto mode, you can turn the switch towards auto. If you want to use it with pedal, then turn towards jog mode. Now the next step would be to pour your liquid or paste into the tank. Once that is done, we need to set the flow of liquid. Take an empty container, put it under the nozzle. Then, in order to increase the paste flow, turn the first throttle valve shown in the video in anti-clockwise direction. If it is too fast, you can turn the same valve in clockwise direction to decrease the liquid flow. Once the flow consistency is set, you need to set the amount of liquid you want to fill inside your bottle. To do that turn the hand wheel to set the flow. You need to do trial and error a couple of times in order to set the correct amount. Now let's try to fill few containers in manual mode using pedal. Put the container under the filling nozzle and then press the pedal to discharge the liquid. You can continue this process until all your containers are filled. As mentioned before, this machine can also run in auto mode. To do that, firstly we need to set the wait time, the backward movement flow of the piston after each discharge, so that the operator would get time to replace the container. To decrease the wait time, turn the second throttle valve in anti-clockwise direction. If it is too fast, turn the throttle valve in clockwise direction and the wait time would increase. We would recommend keeping the wait time high so that the operator would have time to replace the container. Now we can start filling the liquid inside the containers in auto mode. The main feature of this machine is that it discharges precise dose of your product each time every time. Before switching off the machine first you need to stop the airflow and then turn off the machine. This step is very important so that the piston will come back to its default position. If you are a startup, this machine is best suited to fill wide variety of liquid products which are manufactured in food industry, cosmetic industry, chemical and paint industry.